Awad. Like you said, it's not just about the night show. These girls are going all day long. A lot of them have sponsors, which is so crucial in this sport because, as you can see, these suits are not cheap. So they've been spending all day at the booth with their sponsors. Competitor number eight, Darlena Brown. They all look so incredibly graceful in those heels, too. That's not easy. Competitor Everybody number nine, to Heather May French. To walk in their five inch heels, no doubt. Gracefully. Lots of style. You know, you'll laugh, but I used to get up every morning, put mine on, and cook breakfast in them just to get so incredibly used to wearing them. Amy Fry. Competitor number 10, Jessica Fry. These girls don't even look tired. You can definitely tell they're pros. They, they may have been eating a lot of peanut butter and honey backstage to keep them to keep them going. Something gave them energy back there, the rice cakes and peanut butter. Which is an interesting topic too. It's always fun to see the dynamic backstage. You know, you've got the, the primping, you've got the nerves, you've got the funny. 12, Jennifer Gates. I was, just food. Yeah, I was just backstage actually and somebody fed me a rice cake with peanut butter on it because I was hungry. And you know what? They're all so laid back, relaxed, having fun together. It's a great camaraderie backstage today. Competitor number 13, Lene Hernandez. You know, something to mention too, this is the fun part. Up to here has been all the work. Now it's time for them to showcase all that hard work and just relax and have fun with it. The judging at this point is pretty much done. The judges have a good idea where the placings 14, are. Julie Ann Kula. The nervousness is, is far gone at this point. Now they're just, okay, let's get out there. Let's have some fun. Let's smile, strut our stuff, and see where the cards may fall. Competitor like number 15, Mary Elizabeth Lido. Like you mentioned, these girls are all really close. They're friends. There's, it's such a good energy. You can see them as they become more and more relaxed throughout the night. Competitor number 16, Jenny Lynn. Competitor number 17, Hazel Nelson. What a thrill for all of our 14 rookies to be walking on this stage tonight. I think it's still surreal for all of them. And you know, I have to be honest, you really cannot see a drastic difference Jessica Putnam. between the rookies and the experience. These rookies have stepped up to the plate. They know what they're up against, and they are absolutely ready. It takes a lot of practice at home, too, walking around the house in your heels. Number 19, Seville Rodanine. Practicing your walk and your strut. It's something that does not that does take time. The posing practice is just as important as the training in the gym for, for these contests. You've got to be absolutely polished. Competitor number 20, Crystal Richardson. It's interesting, too. A lot of these girls coach the upcoming athletes that are amateurs. They spend a lot of time working with the newcomers to help them get these turns and these moves all polished. Everything is Competitor technically number 21, perfect. Competitor Felicia Romero. This isn't just a hobby, Kim. This ends up being a full-time job, as you know. The girls that are actually going to school or working or having or that have kids at home and are getting ready for shows with the prep. Number 22, Cassidy Sloan. The prep involved is mind-boggling. Like you say, there's there's so many things involved. It's not just it's not just a little diet and training and walking on stage. There's a lot.